and welcome back to another video! And welcome back to another video, and my voice is actually feeling a bit better. Um, now this wasn't my original plan for um, my first video of the month, but, um, you know, these just came out of the blue, so it's like, eh, might as well. Um, because I ordered a few things off Wish, and the, the couple of them I do think are a little bit funny. So I might as well just like, be like, hey, look at these funny things I bought off Wish. Just because. Um, and a couple of things are nice. Like, quite nice that, that I actually do want to show off. Ah, so. What do we have in this first one? And this is a smaller one, by the way. It's all wrapped up and I don't have my scissors to hand because they're in my drawer. Which I also have a thing. Um, and I also think I put my sharp knife out there. Yay, brilliant planning from me. I'm just going to have to saw the sellotape out without scissors or anything. Jesus Christ. Hold on, can I just pull it out? I can just pull it out. Okay, what what is this first one? Oh, yeah. Right, this, this is um, one of the nice things I got. If I can get it to unroll. I just... Ah! These, spe these two have spent a couple of uh, while rolled up, but... It's, yeah, it's a nice picture of Stanley. It's like a little memorial thing. So I thought that would be nice to get. And it was free, and all I had to pay was purchase and packing, so I thought, why not? And while I was there, there was another one with the exact same offer, which I also decided to get, which I also think is quite nice. So it's got, like, all of the little, like, Marvel characters. And you've got, like multiple faces of characters making up Pet Stanley's face. So yeah, I just think these are really cool and really nice. Um, and Stanley was a great man. I don't think I ever made a video about his death, but brilliant man. Made some brilliant, well not really made, but you know, helped with brilliant movies. And we would not, if it weren't for him, we wouldn't have any of the Marvel comics or characters that we have today. So they can go over there. And now there's one other item that I got. It's a bit bigger. Oh yes! Oh, I've been waiting for this. So this is like um, a fan-made thing I do believe I found on Wish and it's like might as well get at least one of them because I and I got the one of my favourite one. Um, and you'll get what I'm talking about, but I'm, not, I'm trying to not spoil it right now. So. Oh. This is actually quite nice. Maybe like, uh, considering it being like a um, fan made thing, it's actually not, not that bad. Alright, there's. Definitely wear some plushes out there. Yeah, Mimikyu, e e Evolutions plush on Wish. And I saw, uh, I love Mimikyu, like Mimikyu is my all time favourite Pokemon. And Espeon is my favourite Evolution. I love si uh, Espeon, not Sylveon, Espeon. Uh, so it's like, eh, might as well get an Espeon Mimikyu. And it, I do love like this ca the kind I do like the fan as where like you have like different Mimikyu disguises and yeah it is, it is nice having a um a Sylveon Mimikyu and there's a good thing both of these came on the same well all three of them technically but yeah those two came in the same one but yeah it's a good thing they came today because I don't think I could really make a decent size video I was just like Mimikyu Espeon Espeon Mimikyu yeah, he is cute. Um, can I just bit this bit there? There we go. Yeah, that looks good. I've actually run out of places to put um, plushies because um, if I just take this camera quickly. Above my TV, I have a uh, bayonet plush and an old the parrot plush I've had since I was a kid. Got a um, sable eye plush over there, 
and above my bed I have a Rowlet plush. So yeah, and Mimikyu is buried underneath a bunch of stuff on there that all of that really needs sorting out. It is just a bit of a mess. I know that these mugs aren't dirty, they're clean, I just ran out of space in the cupboard to put them. But yeah, um, I'll probably get these two like framed one day. Because that is really nice, nice to be honest. I do like that. So I'll probably get the these framed at some point, and then um, I'll probably like ha hang them, hang them up in my room somewhere. I've actually got a few things that I want framing. I've got these two, and over here, I've also got um, this, which some of you might remember from my ukulele unboxing. Ah, ukulele switch edition unboxing. There we go. I have this I want to get uh, framed as well. And um, my dad's friend owns a second hand shop, and um, he uh, had a um, Generation One uh, uh, poster of the original 151 Pokemon on it. And it is in really good condition, so I'm probably going to show that off and get that framed at some point, because that's just like, yeah, you find something called that that rare, um, and then you're going to frame it. You're, you're framing that. One more thing I can show off in this video, if I just quickly put my headphones down. Alright. This has gone from more from an unboxing video to more of a show and tell video, but ah, I, I have some cellotape. I, mean, I can just take that off, and if I need, I can replace it. Okay, well, mm. there's a lot of cellotape. Probably going to be cellar tape on the other side as well. Yep. No. Oh. I whacked the mouse. Good thing it didn't stop the, hit the stop record button. Yes. Right, I'm just going to get scissors quickly because I can't get into it. Uh, I I got I bought this off my uh, from my friend's um, second hand shop, um, and it is it's not like super valuable or anything, which is why I feel um, confident in sharing it off because it's like oh because then people can be like oh you're flexing because it's not really like that valuable oh, yeah. Mm. There we go. It's just like a cool little thing I picked up. Ah. And when I get my own flat, I'll probably have this out on decoration at some point. If I get out of the way quickly and move this out of the way as well. Not see much of it, but this is one of those cardboard cutouts that shops put out front. If I can move the camera out front, and these are a little bit hard to get your hands on. Yeah, this is for Breath of the Wild, the Wii U and 3DS, uh, not 3DS, Wii U and Switch. Um, although it would be cool if it was also on the 3DS. So yeah. It's just like, this is a cool little thing that's hard to get your hands on. And maybe one day it'll be worth something, but meh, maybe, maybe, maybe not. It uh, will if I'm lucky. Anyway, 
Uh, that's going to be everything. I've just like got a couple of things to edit out in this. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Right, so this is a couple of days later because I can't read numbers and I misread uh, 5 as an 8. Yeah, I, there's a reason why I need these glasses. Um, mind you, I read it on that those little numbers that they're on my computer, so I probably read them and just, just like looked at them as just assumed it, but there was uh, 8 instead of 5 and decided to record the video. But anyway, it is now the 7th, so the video should be uploaded to. I need to upload a video tomorrow. Well, yeah, because. My, I, we really need to get back to recording Platinum. Anyway, um, this came today, so I think I'll just edit, add it on to the end of this um, video. Uh, because it should take a few seconds of editing. Oh! Okay, wherever I got, it's got Japanese text on it. I think that's Japanese. It could be Japanese or Chinese. Uh, I, I really can't tell the difference. Or Korean. I, I don't I can't read any of them so it could be any of them to be fair. Let me triple check this is mine and I have an accidentally just opened someone else's package. Um uh yeah. My it says my name twice and where I live, so yeah. And no, I'm not gonna say any of that. Fine jewelry. Since when did I order fine jewelry? I don't have a girlfriend to give fine jewelry to or uh, the feminine boy. So what do we have here? Oh yes, I remember this. Um, this is just like a little cool thing that I found on Wish. Um, that I got for my mum because she loves um, like Marvel and all that. So I thought, hey, she might like this. I like it, but I'm not going to wear it. The Eye of Agamotto from Doctor Strange, also known as the Time Stone. That is nice. Because, yeah, it's my mum's birthday next month, so I've been getting her some birthday presents. What's this one? Um. Oh! Yes! I've been waiting for these. Yep, bugger. Where's some ah here we go. And I decided to edit this on to the end of the video because otherwise uh, um the video would just uh, the, you know these wouldn't be ta you know be able to make up an entire video. Also I've got it in my bedroom since last time I recorded, which is nice and everything's not all cluttered anymore. Um, I'm gonna have to take these off to show these off, but Oh yes. Oh yes, I like I like these. Ah. Oh. Yeah. So I do actually already have a pair of sunglasses. Let me just go get them quickly. So here we have my deal with it glasses that we just opened. And here we have my 80s like kind of sunglasses because it's all like um, rainbow and stuff on there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it on the camera. Yeah, it's all like rainbow and stuff. So I picked these up because the, the only other ones I had were just black. So it's like, might as well get 80s style ones because I love the 80s. It is my favorite decade for music. Um, so yeah, I do like these as well. And you can also uh, say this is somewhat representing of the 80s because of his like pixel art style. That uh, was prominent in video games during the 80s. Another reason why I like the 80s is it gave birth to like the Nintendo. I do believe the Nintendo came out in the 80s. Z, what's this? Wallpaper. I think that slightly mislabeled. It's a bit small to be wallpaper. 
Oh yes. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, just that. That is awesome. Oh, I love this. this is, I'm probably gonna. Have, I've got a bunch of stuff to get framed. I gotta get this frame. Gotta get those two frames. Gotta get that frame. And I've also got that Pokemon poster that I need frame. That that I want framing. Oh, when I have my own flat, I'm just gonna have like tons of like posters and everything all over the place. I forgot to put my headset back on. Yeah, you can probably still hear me because I could hear it going up and down a little bit when I was talking. So hopefully you should be able to hear me. Fine, but yeah. Anyway, I guess this time we'll, I'll see you guys in the next episode, unless um, something else comes today. But yeah, um, my throat's feeling a bit better. I still got a bit of a cough, but and I don't have my full vocal range that I usually have, but I can talk, and you can hear me, which is the most important things. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit that like button, comment down below what you thought of this video, and uh, if you want to see more of my stupid face, don't forget to hit that to subscribe and uh, the ring and ding uh, that uh, notification bell, otherwise YouTube won't uh, notify you of when I'm uploading videos for some unknown reason. And I'll see you guys in the next video.